Now it's for me, I ain't got it Carbon, skimming, looting, hide your body As long as you dreaming about me, ain't no problem I don't got nobody just with you right now But the truth, I look better under you I can lose when I'm with you Welcome to my Dollar Tree inspired shower routine where I wanted to go to Dollar Tree. If y'all don't know, that's my favorite, favorite shopping store. But I wanted to go to Dollar Tree to do a shower routine. So I'm going to give you guys my honest reviews on everything that I picked up. I really wanted to create this video to show people that pouring into yourself and self-care, self-love, and it's something as simple as a hydrant routine does not have to be super expensive. Okay, so the first item you guys seen were like little shower tablets. They don't really smell too strong, so I wouldn't have the highest hopes. And you guys gotta remember, a lot of this stuff is $1.25. So to me, I feel like that's worth it for majority of these things especially just to get yourself clean the shower tablets are just like a little you know bonus item then we go into the dry brush this is the only option that i seen for them and then i showed you guys in comparison to my dry brush that i got from target the one on the dollar tree is softer and, and some of the hairs were coming out but it was not as exfoliating as the original but if you just want to feel like you doing the damn thing just go ahead and go get it because it's a dollar 25 all right so next up let's get into the shower routine so the first thing we're going to do is clean our body with an antibacterial soap they also do have a Dr. Bronner's Peppermint Dupe, if you've never heard of it. They also do have the regular yellow dial soap or the regular white dial soap. I prefer the dial soap. I just wanted to get this one that they have in their brand because it comes with two soap bars. So that's actually a steal. I feel like I would just personally go with the dial. It wasn't nothing wrong with this, but I just think I'm used to the dial version. And they also have washcloths. And if y'all don't know, these rough washcloths are where it's at because it's low-key like exfoliation. But if you want something softer, that's up to you. You could go to the baby section and get like a baby washcloth if you want like a softer feel. But if you don't know, we need to be doing two cleanses. So our first cleanse is to get all the oil, bacteria, dirt off of our body and then go in with our we'll smell goods. But for right now, this white washcloth, I actually recommend because I like now using white washcloths to see all the dirt and stuff come off my body. Like I just have this thing about wanting to feel so freaking clean. All right, for me, I like to then go in with my exfoliating net with my body wash. So I was just showing you guys the different options that they had at the Dollar Tree. I went to, they had this like coconut exfoliating net, then this purple regular exfoliating net, a back bath brush, and they have bar soaps and body washes. And to be honest with you guys, I've tried the pink one is my go-to in this oatmeal almond bar. If you are someone with dry skin, I highly recommend trying this out. But when I tell y'all that purple exfoliating net, their exfoliating stuff is very good. Like that is something where I feel like it may be a little too harsh for some people, but if it is, I would technically just use the white washcloth instead as like exfoliation. But just be prepared, their exfoliating nets are pretty yeah. rough. And they're supposed to be because they're supposed to like help clean your body further. So just to give y'all a pre-warning. And then I added the soap onto the exfoliating net so you guys can see that it does, does sud up really good. And, and it does get really soapy. So this is the wash I've been using for a little while and it, it gets the job done. Just as a further note, I did have to go to two different Dollar Trees to get majority of these items. Sometimes you do have to go to a different Dollar Tree. Not all Dollar Trees do carry the same stuff. So just keep that in mind. But if the one you go to doesn't have certain things, just try to pick up at least a few of these items. You don't need every single item. I just wanted to show you guys a majority of the possibilities if you're someone who is more of on a budget or doesn't feel as if they can romanticize their shower routine because honey at the dollar tree this is all from the dollar tree you can romanticize your life any way you want but next up i did get this exfoliating cotton candy scrub and honestly it wasn't given as i thought it would but i did put it under my underarms because i am going to get into shaving next and they also do have like a variety of different exfoliating scrubs if you guys want to try them. But this is just the one that I picked up. I'm just someone who naturally gravitates towards like a six blade razor. I just feel like the more blades, the quicker and easier we could get this done, okay? And I've actually never been into shaving creams, but I want to show you guys. And I also did see shaving oils. I know that's really popular right now. But the only thing I really shave, to be honest, is my underarms. So that's what I'm showing you guys. And I feel like... 
it got the job done but i can say i feel like the blade it was a little hard going across my skin like it wasn't smooth but i did see that they had like name brand razors that i'll probably try and that you guys could probably try but it wasn't nothing too bad and it came with multiple heads but it, so maybe the shave oil it could be a little slicker as it passed and i didn't have any cuts or anything so i feel like it's still worth it you guys honestly with the dollar tree it's a hit or miss but also i don't like to tell people not to get something i like to tell you to try it because i might have a different experience than you so don't just go based off my word but you know keep my word as like in the back of your head so i highly recommend getting an exfoliating glove when it comes to exfoliating the girl down there that's where i was pointing to i was trying to make it known and i'm currently using my regular feminine wash but dollar tree does have feminine wash now i'm a little scared of those so i ain't, i didn't get that but i would recommend dove sensitive bar and only exfoliate the outside of your girl okay you don't need to stick nothing up there you don't need to clean the inside it does it for you but you do need to clean down there that's something on tiktok that actually was going viral you do need to clean the outside the lips the crevices of your thighs right around that that's the the glove gets it good we will not be having any free feet content but i wanted to show you guys the different options that dollar she does have for their feet that i found and unfortunately i thought this exfoliating foot scrub was about to eat because i'm like it says brown sugar and almond oil it just was not given the consistency I thought it was going to give. So if you want to try it, just don't expect too much. But now we're going to move into body care. And I honestly think Dollar Tree's lotion is pretty good. And it is thick. I, I accidentally went in with a little too much. It took me a little minute to get this into my skin. But it's real thick. And I definitely, I just am a cocoa butter type of girl. So as if you should get like lotion that has a purpose and then smell good lotion for later if that makes any sense and i also got some body oil to put on top and oh this smells so good coconut and you can't go too wrong with a oil so if they mess up the coconut oil i would be a little scared but they do have multiple types of oils like i said you just gotta look around i promise you i hope this video has opened your eyes to know that dollar tree is hitting okay in the past i used to i used to sleep on dollar tree too but it's been hitting lately and of course, they have deodorant. I usually don't wear deodorant to bed, but for the video purposes, I want to show you guys. And something else that I wanted to get into is trying the guy. How do you say that word? Guy. Guy. I'm gonna say the word glycolic toner under my arms and Dollar Tree actually does carry that now I, I just know they're just not gonna be the strongest that it could be but I feel like it's still a good option at least they have it for some people to try and the last thing that I'm doing is that I just recently started getting into and I'm in love with this like little hack situation is a body mist or perfume before going to bed like that is like top tier a way to romanticize your life and as you guys can see these little body mists a dollar 25 and they do smell good and some of them literally say no alcohol and i feel like that's good especially when you're going to bed because you're going to be like laying in this the last thing that i have is foot care so i have petroleum jelly which is the go-to i usually use aquaphor but dollar tree doesn't carry aquaphor after exfoliating your feet put in some aquaphor and they have these little cute man they have these little cute house shoes say what you want about me i don't be caring what nobody got to say these little house slippers and they have like sock slippers and stuff i highly recommend putting that on after you know the aquaphor i hate is stepping on the floor and it's on my feet like ew but they also did have this repair cream and I, and I like the repair cream but yeah the exfoliating scrub was not giving but this is everything for the freaking dollar tree shower routine i hope this video helps anyone watching who needs it it also shows you that you can romanticize your life on a budget and that's what my videos are for so if you guys are new to the channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you guys been subscribed thanks for showing love and i will see y'all in the next video